A mom and her newborn are dead following a car crash Friday afternoon. Police say that there weren't any safety seats in the car. This wreck and the death of her daughter and grandson aren't the reasons why Belen Henry came to Phoenix. Because she said, Mom, Josiah needs a swing, and I said, okay. And I still have it. I have a swing. It's in my car, just sitting in there. And he's never going to get to use it. One month old Josiah and his mom, Christina Laura, died Friday afternoon. Police believe a driver in a pickup sped through a yellow light, made a left turn, and crashed into Laura's car with her four kids inside, killing the 25 year old mom and her newborn. Josiah, he was just barely beginning his life. And, you know, like, he just recently just, like, started smiling. Police say the kids were not in safety seats, which haunts Henry and her partner. No matter whose fault it is, no matter what the situation, it can't bring our daughter back or our grandson back. So it's just everybody just be out there wearing your seatbelts. Henry describes her daughter as generous and loving. She just had a heart of gold. And I know everybody always says that about their kid, but I can honestly say that that was my child. And she says Christina was just starting to get her life together. They got their own place and they got you know, their their car, you know, whatever. And, you know, they had a lot, they had four kids. So were all the kids, you know, buckled up? We don't, we don't know. know. But what she does know is that those extra precautions may have saved her daughters and her grandson's lives. Seatbelts. Seatbelts, yeah. Wear your seatbelts and buckle them kids up. And the family has set up a GoFundMe, not only for the funeral expenses, but the medical ones as well, as the one-year-old granddaughter continues to fight for her life in the hospital. In Phoenix, Adam Mincer, ABC 15, Arizona.